Wow. Are you serious? He's still chasing me? Oh, you're joking me. Oh, here. I don't want your children. Wrong game, mischief. Oh god! Um, face cam will be on the actual videos. Because it's la it lags way too much when I do it on, uh, Twitch. Alright, come here, Vin. Oh god, he's actually catching up with me. Where am I going? I just went backwards. I went in a complete freaking circle. Eh. 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 I'll get there eventually. Here comes the bride. Here comes the bride. I don't want to turn into a girl. Where am I going? I don't know where to go. Mmm, the way you massacre those bodies is so... So hot. Yeah, like that, Mischief? <laughs> is that how I should flirt with them? I think I'm good. I think I'm safe. I'm just crawling slowly and hoping he doesn't find me. Oh, screw it. There has to be a way around. There has to be a way out of here. Is this it? No. Okay, it has to be... It has to be in here. It has to be somewhere in this room. <laughs> I'm confused because I keep going in a circle. Like, I'm not sure which way I'm supposed to go. Hmm. Oh shit, he's coming.
<laughs> I always thought I would look beautiful in a wedding dress. You know, lots of frilly, frilly edges, flowers. I, I thought about knitting it myself, actually. Oh shit, move. <clears throat> Maybe in this room, because it's the wedding room. You are mean! <laughs> Oh, wait a minute! It said I needed to find a key! Maybe there's a key on the body over here. Alright, limp over, limp over, come on. Yeah, there it is! Okay, so I need to... F I need to find a break to get to... To get to the room. Okay. I'll rip your womb from your blood guts. I don't have a womb. Oh boy, move, 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 move. Oh god. Oh god, he's right behind me. Ugh. Yes! Success! What? Oh, God! One more. I try. And I try. Ow. Ow. You can hang like the rest of them. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Please don't. Please don't. Heavier than you look. If this is you on the honeymoon, I hate oh, no. to imagine. Anniversary. Screw you, I want a divorce. Hold still. God damn it, what are you? Oh, damn it, darling. No, you need to be safe. Oh. Nope, 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 nope. We could have been beautiful. Sorry, dude. You just didn't have the potential. You have been eliminated from the Bachelorette. He's dead, the amateur surgeon, father to be, husband. His gut shredded and pulled from his belly. I'm trying not to laugh. Oh god, Lisa, I swear to you, I'm trying. Oh my god. That went directions. 
So what, do I have a permanent limp now? S screw him. Male ward. Won't be something on this door. Oh. I think it was. I think it did get, like, penetrated through the groin. Corporate cops, mercenaries, private military contractors, whatever they call them now, they're as helpless as the rest of us need to get out, escape. Amen. Okay, guys, we are getting to the nitty gritty, I think. Wow, we're getting into the military f side of things. Groundwork has been laid to ensure an uneventful egress from Rudolf work. I understand. Warnick was sufficiently distracted by the partial success of patient Billy Hope. Even minimal exploitation of these resources is hard to overestimate. I hope the new faculty is sufficiently shielded to allow female staff so I can see what comes with my own eyes. Oh, please. You know what I say to that, Aqua? Ha! Ha, I say! Because you know what? If I can handle psychopathic killers and people who want to chop off my private parts, I can sure as heck deal with corporate military scum. <laughs> oh. Be nice, everybody. Oh. Wait, did I come this way already? <clears throat> wow, this is this is very pretty. Except the dead body. Just move, just move, just move. Oh my god! Guys, you know what this is? This is the beginning of the Outlast game! We're right where the main character was! Holy shit, we just went full circle! Oh my god, this is so beautiful to see! Oh, it looks like my limp's gone, too. Holy shit, guys, we're back at the main game. I just, oh, oh, oh my god, I just got excited here. What if this is happening almost around the same time as when Miles gets to the asylum? 
Level triple bat black security protocols, including chemical restraint, physical restraint, and other bad stuff. Security clearances for Project Wall Rider will not apply to information regarding patients, yada yada. Now security clearances will be issued and an appropriate protocol to sign. Oh my god, I just got hit by a nostalgia bomb. Somebody hold me. Oh my god. Uh, the the phone is still beeping. The the floors and the walls are still matted with blood. This door is going to close automatically. Or not. Ooh. Oh my god, check it out guys. This is this is it. I'm in partial amazement, but also kind of fear what's going to happen. Oh shit, we're heading for the chapel. Where am I supposed to go? Oh, here we go. Oh, no? Hmm. Alright, where, sh where should I go? Go down? Oh, here we go. Jeremy Blair, my supervisor's supervisor, a man who'd be who seed me skin sated and raped for a promotion and a few martinis, injured, dying if he's not already dead. I'm trying to feel sorry for him, really I am. But there's no way in hell he's stopping me from getting out of this godforsaken place. I'm coming home, Lisa. That's a clear sign that you're not going home. God, I'm stuck with a pig. Uh. <laughs> Oh! No one can know. No one. Oh! Thanks, Wall Rider. Can I can I leave? Can I go now? I'm out of here. I made it! Oh, hallelujah! I made it! I am out of here, guys! Let's go! Uh, I'm limping! I'm limping! Wait a minute. Who the hell is that? Uh oh.
Oh my god. Wait a minute, did you guys see that? It was a press badge. You press that button. It's not going back, Mr. Park. There's enough hard evidence in that video file to make a world of shit for our friends at Murkoff. We got out of Mount Massive alive, and we've done everything in our power to cover your tracks. But our enemies are twitching and malicious corporate paranoics with resources you're too moral to imagine. You won't be the only target. Anyone you care about, your wife, your child, there'll be nothing to murk off but ways to hurt you. I need you to understand the bridge you're crossing here. You will do irrevocable damage to the company. You might even get close to something like justice. But once you click upload, your life is over. Everyone you love is fucked. But it's the right thing to do. Is hurting Murkoff worth that much to you? People need to know about this. Upload. That was it! Wait a minute, it didn't give me any hint of what happened to... to Miles from the first game. Hmm. Was that the same car that Miles came up in when he came to Mount Massive Asylum? Was I in there, in the asylum at the same time as the main character? Hmm. Kind of wondering about that actually, cause. Oh, really? That was the same car? I'm gonna have to look back at the first game and see what car I came in. Because if that's the case, then... The, out, the events of the whistleblower were happening at the exact same time that Miles was going through the asylum trying to find the truth. So this wasn't just a prequel, this was going full circle. The only thing I wish I knew was why the army decided to... Oh. They wanted to clear all evidence of the shit happening. Stop saying I stink. <laughs> So, what I'm kind of gathering is that Miles is for sure dead. The military was obviously coming to clear all evidence that included Waylon Park, but Par Mr. Park actually got out. But Miles wasn't so lucky. He was stuck in the underground lab where all the testing was going. Therefore, the moment they saw him, he had to die. But the one thing I don't get is the fact that, you know, we see the Wall Rider possess Miles in the base game and pretty much rip the, the PMC as a new one. I want to know what happens after that, besides possibly the end of the world. <laughs> but this was a great DLC. This was, this was awesome. Totally matched my expectations and then some of, you know... A true horror game experience. Right down to the last freaking jump scare. <laughs>